Judgment Day for Norm McAllister, the former Republican state senator from Franklin County, convicted by a jury in July of a prostitution-related crime. Before sentencing, Judge Martin Maley heard from the victim, a woman who had rented from McAllister, who she called repulsive and who she said had exploited her for money. McAllister was arrested at the Vermont State House in May 2015, losing his Senate seat in the next election. Through two trials, though, always proclaiming his innocence. The judge at sentencing telling McAllister he had abused his power with behavior that is unacceptable. It's a situation where Mr. McAllister had all the power and the victim in this case had little or none. And he used that power to his advantage. Still, at age 66 and with no criminal record, the judge said jail time would be disproportionate to the crime, instead sentencing McAllister to sex offender treatment, 25 days on a work crew, and one year of probation. Asked what he thought on his way out of the courthouse. I'm saying the same thing I said from the beginning. I was innocent of all of it. I think they got this one wrong, and we're going to appeal it. Were you the victim here? We're not going to go into that. We filed a notice of appeal. Uh, we're, we're going to take it to the Supreme Court, and we're confident that the Supreme Court will overturn this conviction. It might take a little while, but uh, we, we're confident in that. Prosecutors left the courthouse uh, today uh, without commenting. Senator McAllister also faces a civil lawsuit filed by that female victim in the case. From the Live Desk, Stuart Ledbetter, NBC5 News.